What's up, everybody? This is Eric Tippetts. It is a beautiful day here in Southern California, and I wanted to shoot this quick video. I'll title it, How to Get the Results in Anything You Want in Life, uh, both personally or professionally. You know, I've met so many people that I feel like they're working so hard every day, but aren't achieving the results that they're looking for. And here was something that I learned a couple months ago. You know, before I've always been a morning person, but it, you know, starting each day didn't have an exact routine, but woke up early, tried to uh, really invest in myself at least 30 minutes each morning, either reading or meditating or uh, visualization or affirmations and then typically would go to the gym and then come back and really get to work. Well, I found that I, I didn't have an exact routine, that I read this book called The Morning Miracle, and in there it talks about committing to your processes versus the emotional results of actions that you take. Meaning, I, if you just invest in your process, so every morning, I have a process, I have a routine. I wake up, I immediately go downstairs and I spend quiet time, at least 15 to 30 minutes of just time looking at, uh, on my phone I have a vision board that I look at between wealth, between health, between gratitude, uh, love and relationships. All of those I put pictures and I spend at least 15 to 30 minutes just looking at each one of these things and mentally engaging and visualizing myself accomplishing or achieving these things that are most important to me. Then I'll typically, I, I've really got into audiobooks and so I'll spend 30 minutes doing that and then head off to the gym. And so from the gym, I'll spend 45 minutes to an hour and then come home. And that's really where I start to get connected and start to look at emails and things like that. So what I'm saying is that's my process. Every morning I start with that. I know what it is. I start at the uh, previous night. I'll typically do those affirmations and I'll look at that vision board. So during the night, my subconscious is, is uh, remembering that, is realizing that, and it starts my morning with me already in that mindset. So that process makes it to where I'm super confident that if I do that every single day, then get into my day, it starts me on already in the right process. Then throughout the day, I've got my calendar scheduled to where I know I block out time for certain activities that I will complete every single day. Now, here's the difference. And what I really realized after reading this book, The Morning Miracle, is that many times I would get caught up on phone calls and what was the result of that phone call. And think of it in terms of so many people I talk to, They'll say, I'll ask, well, how many days a week are you working your business? And they'll go, you know, when I get the time or uh, a couple hours each week. That's so random that really you just think of your success as random. And so instead of looking at, hey, one day I'm going to work five hours and make 500 phone calls and you wonder why, man, that day the result didn't come and I worked so hard. What I realized is I was doing these peaks and valleys, highs and lows, because I was so caught up in the emotion of the result of did I close and did it get started, did I succeed right at that moment versus if I just work my process every single day and I don't think of the result, what I've realized in the past couple months is that the result just always happens from those little processes that I do every single day. So I eliminate those highs and those lows because just the, the nature of that constant repetitive process, I already know that that result will be there. Now if I want bigger results, I just do more intense processes. I just say, hey, instead of making this many phone calls, I'll double it. And I already know that that process will then equal this result in the end. Now, will it come tomorrow? Will it come next week? Will it come next month? You know, I'm committed to the process. 
So you really got to look at it in terms of if you get a, a new job, would you go into that job and work super, super hard overtime even the first week? And would you expect them to give you a raise the next week? Of course not. They, that's the process. They expect you to do that process. But if you do that over a month, three months, six months, trust me, people notice that. And that's when raises, bonuses, things like that appear because people see that, hey, your value has exceeded your pay. And we need to make sure that, that your pay is equal to the value that you're bringing to our organization. So really think about that as you, uh, as you start each morning. And I recommend, again, I've, uh, every video I recommend reading. I'll tell you what, audiobooks have changed my life. I am just crunching through audiobooks because I literally, every time I drive, I'm listening to them. Every time in the morning, I'm listening to them. Before I go to bed, I'm listening to them. Even as I'm writing emails and stuff, I'll, I'll have it and listening to audiobooks. And what you find is it just gives your your brain so much more perspective and information and ideas and uh, knowledge that you can use and, and take and apply to your business. So really invest in yourself, reading, recommend, great audiobook, The Morning Miracle, starting to understand that get yourself a routine first thing in the morning, start your day in that confident, a focused state and what you'll find is every day it uh, it turns out to be an amazing day just because that process works over and over so so much more to come thank you so much for all the amazing feedback and comments and and uh, emails that I get super excited much more content to come and especially I was telling you at the uh, Eric Worre Network Marketing Pro event so much content to uh, to come with that also. So have a great day. We'll see you soon.